Hello YouTube, welcome to Motorcycling with Carl. Today I am going to be assembling my new workbench for the garage. Um, I'll probably, I'm gonna do an unboxing. I'm probably gonna do it in time-lapse, speed it all up, try to get the footage. I'll stop periodically, maybe say something here or there. But this is like the first item getting assembled for the garage. My plan is to get everything I want, the compressors, the reels, the bench, the cabinets above. I want to set everything up and know where it's going to be. And then I will paint the walls. I got to get some brighter lights in the garage here. But then I'll paint the walls, do everything I'm going to do there. And the last thing I'll do is the floor. So on the channel here, I'll do step by step. Uh, show you what I'm doing in the garage, have some videos. Can't wait to get it all set up. Hopefully it's gonna be nice. Get to work on the bikes, do some stuff in here. So today I'm gonna be assembling my new workbench. I'll show you here. It's a uh, Husky 52 inch work table with adjustable height and two draws. So the height is adjustable. Um, it's got two nice draws in it. I'll show you around the garage. I got the bikes there. The toolbox is probably going to stay there. Right now I have this just little folding card table here. So that's going to go. I have the shelves. They're going to be reworked a little bit because on the bottom, the compressor I bought, I want to mount down there. I want to put a, a reel with a 50 foot compressor hose here. So it's going to be interesting. All right, so I'm going to set up the camera. I'm going to unbox and build this thing. Like I said, I'm going to do it in time lapse. Um, I will leave a link to the, the workbench in the description. If you have any questions, ask me in the comments. Please hit the like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. You'll see me finish this garage up. It's going to be really cool, I think, when it's done. There's my two bikes just hanging out. All right, so stick around and let's see the finished product. on this was very nice everything was packed well um, doesn't appear to be any damage even though the box was a little beat up so that's good news all right so this will be in sped up motion but I'm gonna film me assembling this workbench and I will talk to you when it's all done step one wake up for the gonna rise with the sun step two Get some good, some food in you. Step three, you grow hard about what you wanna be. Step four, fuck everybody, just do your thing. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Yeah. 
Set your affirmations, aspirations I got shit to do, the aftermath of preparation Good food, good mood, blood in circulation One step at a time, yeah that's how you make it Set a goal you control and the steps you take them I try to pick one thought, have some concentration And if I make a mistake, it's called education I try to do this every day, call it replication Wake up, today's gonna be a good day Wake up Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. 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 Today's gonna be a good day. Life ain't easy, y'all. I think there's a reason, though. Ups and downs, just like every different season, y'all. Sometimes I'm high, other times I'm barely breathing, though. You always gotta fight and hide from the demons, y'all Negative thoughts are poison, they ride uh. Head full of flaws, so here come the clouds uh. They'll never stop unless I can swap All the bad for the good in my head when I'm lost uh. Yeah, so I'ma fake it till I make it Positive thoughts are overtaking, I got patience One day at a time is how you operate a cadence A flow, you grow, you show yourself a foundation Stay away from all the shit that causes temptation I know that I like to do it cause of sensation I live my life in my head like a narration Don't expect greatness, do my best, man, I'll take it Wake up, today's gonna be a good day Wake up, today's gonna be a good day There it is, the finished product, my new workbench. It's got two drawers. They're, you know, they're kind of thin. You're not going to put tall stuff in there, but it's nice to have two extra drawers for storage. Um, it comes with the option of you could put it on regular feet and leave it in one place, or you could put it on the casters. Um, you could then leave it where you want it, lock the casters, and you're good. But if you want to roll it out and move over to where you're working, or if you want to roll it out to clean or do something, you can. It's really nice. And it's got the handle here. You turn this, and it raises and lowers the height of the bench. So you can go higher or lower with it. Um, like I said, I'm going to leave the link in the description. For this bench, uh, I think it was $2.99 plus tax. That brace in the back there, you can mount that in the center if you want, or in the back, they give you two options. I wanted it back so my feet and my stool will fit underneath. 
So the assembly was, was pretty easy considering how many parts it looked like it was. It went together fairly quick. It was about an hour and a half, hour and 45 minutes. Um, if you're not filming a video, probably it'll go faster. My only complaint is when you're done, it was packaged so well that you have so much garbage from it, it's incredible. But that's it. The first step in, the new, in setting up the garage, getting the workbench together. Now I gotta clean up some of that mess and get rid of that table. But we'll work on that. The next video I'm gonna do is I got a new compressor coming. So I'm gonna do a video on that. I'm gonna show you guys what compressor I got, um, you know, what air hose I got. So it'll be pretty cool. So do me a favor, hit the like button, subscribe, stay tuned for more in the garage here. You know, we'll get the garage set up and then we'll work on some bikes and we'll do some fun stuff. All right, until next time, this is Carl saying laugh a lot, be nice, and stay safe.